Hi everyone, today I'm going to watercolor paint for the pepper. So when you see the pepper, there is something different, uh, um, different parts, which is almost like triangle, but got a curve here. So I'm going to use the light line, so easy to sketch first. So just like a nice and thin line. This is just little fun video. So no pressure. Just simplify the vegetable. And there is also hole there. And and this part got a little thick line which is uh, the light is coming this way so this part is gonna shadow like that and also this is shadow of this paper So it's going to be the shadowy shadow part here and you see this part got uh, some shadow of gradient up here so I'm going to just do like that bring the warm brush and put it in the water and I'm using the permanent orange and then mix with the lemon yellow in a simple color so this part is gonna be intensive color and then this is not the um, proper watercolor paper it's just normal paper so mustn't stay so long of your brush and the water on the on the paper just quickly make a touch in here so this part is gonna be a quite a dark part so I'm using um, red color almost vermilion color So you see these parts also are a shadow. So I just make an accent here. And this part is quite a bright part. To make uh, shapes nicely. And here as well. And there is gonna be different color. I'm using Van Dyke Brown and adding more Van Dyke Brown, which is the color that I'm making already. And then shadow as well. Consistence gradient. from here to there also these parts I'm gonna put more accent almost like red and brown for the dark part here like that and here I'm gonna change in the color the permanent green color and then adding Van Dark Brown. So I only use the limited palette that I show you, only three of seven colors. 
I think this is quite the main color. You see, I I hold the brush quite closer, so easy to detail. that little dark pot in here and here so actually I'm I'm painting for the vegetables and fruits these days it's simple very simple and easy to get the subject and bring it in the table so it's very simple and easy I'm adding more color the second layer of maybe these parts you see these parts it's got a almost medium tone like that because first layer already dry up nicely Thing. I'm rubbing out is too much, and here is gonna be a uh, shadow. You see, almost dark color. It depends on the subject. I use a different color of the shadow. If uh, if the vegetables color is like warm and orange or red color, I'm using almost the Van Dyke brown for the uh, shadow. But if, uh, for example, if broccoli is or kind of greenish color of the fruit or vegetable. I'm using the uh, shadow for almost greenish and ultramarine blue. Okay, today's uh, I think it's off now. So hope you guys enjoy my painting and your watercolor painting. Uh, you don't really need to rush, no pressure. Just enjoy your painting process. Thank you for watching my video. See you next time. Bye.